You're watching the Canon Studio Solutions software tutorial series. This is the fourth video of eight. We're about to take a look at how Studio Solution can help you with transferring photos from camera to the software and how to make adjustments to files and images. Studio Solution can be configured to acquire your photos in four different ways. A tethered camera using USB, using Wi-Fi with the wireless file transmitter, with a hot folder where the software will import photos as they are dropped in a folder, and finally, by manually importing them from a drive or memory card. Let's walk through how to set up both tethered and wireless cameras. It's almost time for the shoot, and you need to get your camera ready. First thing you need to do is go to your menu bar and click on Cameras. My Studio is set up to use either a USB tethered or wireless camera. This lets me import photos as they're captured right into Studio Solutions software. And I don't even have to think about it, which is nice and saves time. To tether the camera directly to Studio Solution, I connect the camera with a USB cable. Then, I turn on the camera and Microsoft Windows lets me know when it detects it. I cancel out of this window. What I want is for the software to detect the camera. So in the lower left corner, click Detect. And right now, you can see an image of my EOS camera. Once Studio Solution sees your camera, you can shoot. So that's how you tether a camera. If you choose to shoot wirelessly, under the Select Camera Type menu, simply click on Wi-Fi Camera. Just keep in mind that you'll also need a Canon wireless file transmitter using an FTP server, and you'll also need a wireless connection. I'd like to take a second look at some of the camera section interface. At the bottom of the screen, you'll notice five distinct tabs for managing your photography studio. The one I want to take a look at now is Photo Library. This is where you store, organize, and manage all photos and albums. You'll also want to use Photo Library if you'd like to import photos from your card reader. In the menu bar up here, click on Add Photo. You'll get a pull-down menu where you'll see Import. Click on that and navigate to your memory card. Add Photo lets you import photos from locations on your computer or an external drive without exiting the software. Now that all of your images are loaded in Studio Solution, you can add data to each photo's file and make image adjustments. To enhance how your photos are organized, you can change a file's properties. Let's have a quick look on how to do that. Again, we're in the photo library. Right now, we're in preview mode. Let's select a photo from the portrait folder. At the very top of the screen, click on Photos. We want to select Properties. And in the Photo Data tab, you can add information like the school name. Then, if you want to automatically apply the same border to all photos with that same school name, it's easily done. While we're here in Photo Library, you can examine a photo's exposure. The histogram can help you do that. Just click on the photo. Now up here on the right, you see Show Data. Here's where you can access the histogram. You can dig deeper. Just click on the graph for the separate histogram charts. And if you'd like to have a larger view, double-click the photo, and it takes you directly into Photo Workshop. Down here in the Enhance tab, we have access to the really helpful Loop tool. It magnifies what we need, which is always helpful when editing. Note the RGB settings at the top right. Also, we can make quick changes like black and white and vignette. Simple and fast, no waiting around. For more options, let's go to the Correct section. On the right, we have options for contrast, exposure, shadows, and more. And then, here in the Color Balance section, we have convenient features for adjusting image colors. What kind of light did you shoot in? Maybe daylight? Maybe tungsten? And here in Color Balance, if you double-click, are sliders for convenient adjustments. Quick and easy. Now, if you shoot RAW files, Studio Solution offers RAW enhancements as well. Let's go back to Photo Library and click on a RAW file and bring it into Photo Workshop. Over here in the right-hand column, you see a list of picture style options. These are specific to RAW files that will tailor your images to the lighting, subject, and personal preferences. You can adjust contrast and exposure and do so much more as per your needs. 
These are the same picture style settings seen in your EOS camera. Okay, by now you should have an understanding of how to connect the camera, modify files, and to make a few adjustments with some of the tools available with Canon Studio Solution. USB or wireless camera control. Manually import photos. Photo data tagging and keywording. Photo enhancements. Picture styles for RAW files. Up next, we'll take a look at photo retouching. Thanks for watching Canon Studio Solution Tutorial.